Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how to record from two webcams onto your laptop and a Mac. And, um, and I'm also going to show you how to choose angles by being your own director because it's so nice and it adds dimension when you can do this, cut to this, continue talking for a few seconds, then go back and look at this camera and continue talking for a few seconds and then go back and forth. And what you can do is while you're editing this in your timeline, you just cut to the angle that the person is looking at. And I'm going to show you how to do that right now in LJ's How To. Okay, so the first thing I did is get two webcams together. Now, I don't have two standalone webcams. So what I did is I uh, opened up my laptop and I decided to try using the webcam that's built into this MacBook Pro, late model one, and then plug in my um, external webcam. And that's what I did. And being that this is a newer Mac, you needed an adapter. So that's what I did here. I'm going to show you how to get two separate stream recordings of each webcam. So here we go. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is open up uh, Finder. And we're going to search for QuickTime Player. Type it right. Two words, type in. And we're going to bring in the app. Um, it's easier in icon mode and what we're going to do is right click it and click duplicate and give it a second it should pop up and then what I do is just to make things a little bit more organized I mark this QuickTime player 2 all right so now we're going to open up each one separately so let's start with player regular one we're going to open this up then we're going to go to file new movie recording and we're going to select the uh, webcam on the laptop right here and I want to use the audio for um, from the laptop for both cameras and this is how you do that. I'm gonna go and make sure that the microphones click there. Okay, so that's set. So let, let's minimize this. And then we're gonna open up QuickTime Player 2. All right, and we're gonna, same thing, we're gonna go to File, New Movie Recording, and then we're gonna choose our second camera, and that's the USB Live camera. Okay, and we're gonna choose, make sure the microphone is picked for this. This way we get consist consistency too. And uh, let's minimize this. All right, so now we have these two cameras ready to go. We have the main one, the laptop, and we have the, uh, the external one right there. And what we're going to do is start them both. Okay, make sure that's selected. Click that. Select this. Click that. Now they're both running, and what I like to do is use a clapboard or just clap. And that's so you can sync that up later on. Um, while you're editing it and there you go so now both quicktime apps are now recording each camera that's pretty cool right and then when we're done you can um, either click stop and then save as or here's a, a quick way to do it is i just click the x and it asks you uh to save so i'm gonna make this quick Time three A and save it. That's done. And then I'm going to click this and quick quick time three B. 
All right, and that's saved. And then um, import the videos. Hopefully you remembered where you saved it. I did. And then uh, I use Filmora 11 for video editing. And then uh, do what you got to do. Awesome. Oh yeah, by the way, if you want to find out how to edit the two different camera angles, you can check out my video right here and I show you how to do it in Filmora 9, but it applies to Filmora 10, 11, or maybe even other editing programs. But uh, check it out. I'm sure it'll help you. Thanks for watching.